Our theme of this uh, couples fellowship go nourishing and cherishing for God's kingdom um, advancement. Ephesians chapter 5. Verse 15. See then that you walk circumspectly, not as fools, but as wise, redeeming the time, because the days are evil. Therefore, do not be unwise, but understand what the will of the Lord is. And do not be drunk with wine, in which is dissipation, but be filled with the Spirit, speaking to one another in psalms and hymns and spiritual songs, singing and making melody in your heart to the Lord, giving thanks always for all things to God, the Father, in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, submitting to one another in the fear of God. Wives, submit to your own husbands, as to the Lord. For the husband is head of the wife, as also Christ is the head of the church, and he is the savior of the body. Therefore, just as the church is subject to Christ, so let the wives be to their own husbands in everything. Husbands, love your wives, just as Christ also loved the church and gave himself for her, that he might sanctify and cleanse her with the watching of water by the word that he might present her to himself a glorious church, not having spot or wrinkle or any such thing, but that she should be holy and without blemish. So husbands ought to love their own wives as their own bodies. He who loves his own wife loves himself. For no one ever hated his own flesh, but nourishes and cherishes it, just as the Lord, as the Lord does the church. For we are members of his body, of his flesh, and of his bones. For this reason a man shall leave his father and mother and be joined to his wife, and the two shall become one flesh. This is a great mystery, but I speak concerning Christ and the church. Nevertheless, let each one of you in particular so love his own wife as himself, and let the wife see that she respects her husband. Amen. Nourishing and cherishing for God's kingdom advancement. Um, open the quote to advance. We are talking of um, pushing beyond where a particular object has been, like the two first day. I want to say, advance here. If I put up, can quire quite be gay able or audible. Yeah, we limit your noble quite negent. Now, chalk and advance here is like to, to push it beyond a born noble. Only a bear a lazy chinic as did I and God had a man spect. No, God did it by all the years. God name is faith. Now get push here beyond. All no go boundary set. All get all get carry beyond boundary. Amen. And uh, for this thing to happen, uh, something must happen first. When we talk about advancing the kingdom, we are simply looking at Genesis. Also, we go to case Rifenin and give man dominion. He gave man control. He said, let them, when they put them, how they put them, as couple, as a couple, or as couples, let them have what? Dominion. Over, 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 over. Amen. I'm an atupu God, I go by you, God, they make a lot of investment in our lives. Every God know with this church, kita abu eba in echebu, abu eba inob, umu ebe, I know now. And 
My prayer also is that God will get you the same page. Because all the possible. Oh, no. Nah. Mother, I'm not sure you're God, no. On each and every born of Coca Megan, Coca no. Chen all the yon will be before Coca Gano. Or let's say a few yon will be before because Oka will food in here, but God be an another dimension now. A bygo. I been in Nanya. In a Nanya, a bygo. The first thing God may address me, the issue of our work. Work, that is work. Abro work, okay. Hello, hello. W A L K. Epota, O to I say, B O B. So, in the so work circumspectly, that is a kind of work carefully. In the translation, by carefully. Eh? NIV. Can you NIV, boy? Be careful. Be careful. Yes. Walk circumspectly. Why are you being careful? Why? Verse 1 and 2 of that Ephesians. Look at verse 1 and 2. Therefore, be imitators of God as their children. And walk in love as Christ also has loved us and given himself for us an offering and a sacrifice to God for a sweet smelling aroma or savo. Now, O King James, we call it savo. Okay? Now, thank you. If you just walk carefully with you, then when you now imitate. Praise the Lord. Aye to go again. Amara. Taiwan. As imitators. I think they were imitating Japan also. And I think from history, Japan also imitated the other country. Huh? Japan imitated the other country. England. Uh -huh. so, so, do you know that Japan, Gurogyo Habu, imitation? Please, I don't know what they were feeling. Huh? Uh -huh. Now, today, Comparing Taiwan with China, China goods, at least in Ghana, import Nigeria. I don't mean the whole along the China now, but in Ghana, Bunya Yaema. How do you see it? Eh? Taiwan original. So now for that, what brought about it? They were careful to imitate. So in verse 15, Bona say, walk circumspectly. You just walk circumspectly. Jegaria na na inesia nya ofuma. Ni na emwero nyo no na imitate. Biko mu chineke. Oh, hallelujah. Go ya na imitate. Ah? Jesus. Aka, many of us carry with excuses. God has called them reasonable in their marriage. More than all that, if you have really following Jesus, anytime time actually with those excuses to justify yourself, if for Jesus, you bow. Yeah, if for Jesus, say no one. Please, are we together? Eh? I have came with excuses. I'm not going to end it. Eh, you may find your men a marriage, you have a gonna my wife. Ah, if for Jesus, because no Jesus can make any. You know, you just walk, you know, and then you know, imitate. Now, be very careful because can the moment ever the moment of the moment in a moto, but they will get more moto. Can you wave? Thank you. The very first day you be the Mumamoto, your feelings, you were very careful. Abi? 
iji desi estiar na akike enwenye magi na ekelegi eh what were you trying to do you had a teacher okay enwenye whether is a former teacher or not for just got an enwenye kuzere gi mo anwenye kuzere ma nokta mbu moto nya ebi onya onya na so onya on me to on me to even some of us automatic kai kai na anya for the man ya bere ni manual maka the last time one one brother je ogbaru je mu manual ha akwa wo and sometimes when we give you a dog sand so ya man ke na amu amu Praise the Lord. You know, eh? I think the first day, I'm going to say, I'm going to say, I think, I'm going to say, 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 because he is going to say, oh, Chineke, because, oh, Lord, please. I'm going to say, 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 I'm going Odo ho with you the fear I did be that day. Obo hai hai be this time I enter here by God's grace unless man chezo I will have to pray before I move. But odo ho can ga because you na chick chineke be go. Because me jini fa bu mad. And the here ebu nem. Things like that. Because just because just ni ni maka. Ni ni maka. Teacher gana ask eh. Oya. Do like this. Ngwe ike me if ihe ka nwe ike no le be ni pode pole nko ozo ime ke ni e gba break cha se bubri an uzo hi you see because you were you are just imitating praise the lord and most times i do in accident mba na me imitate eh ke mbe di nwa accident mbuyi chere ni imege ne e mara chago amota gom fortunately our subject matter bu marriage enwere graduation so si ihe enwere bu from one level to gene enwere graduation ile in christ biko no graduation So you make a to bigo hana ga na e marago. Bidoko ga ayo ba chukun no biga o biga chukwa e bana gene. Oba kwa na ero. So because we are imitating Christ. Gene ka Bible igbo kpodu. Kedi ya imitation bu nibo. Mo mi. Oh thank you brother. Mano den ki igbo. Mo kwara Ibo Ibo won kwa imitation Now now in the mind eh imitation bo ku imitation Now about imitation ni igbo sometimes only the interpretation because mom got an ego so on man no imitation now an average person no my imitation o ye ni di ka atogari ara eh na nke a bi je bu imitation so Our sense of imitation bungo mikita na ine ngomi ngwe onya ine ne gara na achoka ya deka amen na achoka ya deka ya now now let's go to that efficiency again move to move to verse verse 17 ose kae gare bunde na amaga ihe kama ndi na amata ihe bu che chineke hm and kae gare the drunk with wine where in his excess what is just trying to do with here don't involve in anything in excess even why na na ekweba um i don't want to believe no alcoholic wine 
He's just simply dealing with avoid excesses. God don't be drunk with it. If you see can I beg you can cause wallow. Maintain moderation. Don't be drunk with wine. Wherein is what? Dissipation. Because to extreme, it begins to attack your being filled with the spirit. Because the most important thing in a believer's life is that not the beginning. Filled with the spirit. Jesus also they can nana menu no nye monso onye nkuzi onye nkasi obi onye na ano na akoko no kwa ya stand by kwa i will give you the spirit so he was teaching us the importance of the spirit not with this spirit kai ga jina speak with one another in hymns and psalms and what spiritual songs making melody we are in our hearts to the Lord. Now, please, anyway, a very small preamble in Chonka. God help our hearts to get. Do you know that by the time God will be able to make a marriage, then we go sit in anyway. Eh? Because I want you to follow. Then we go sit in. Then we sit in. That is, open our secretary. Uh, submitting to each other. Eh? It is in the atmosphere of of speaking uh, spiritual songs, making melody in the heart, giving thanks to God the Father for all things. Please, are we together? There's a overall atmosphere of yeah, that sometimes when we look at Submitting to one another and some of these things. I need anya as ye de ka law law I we na na ya na na anya ba mu aduka. Emu e setin. Ye have an atmosphere of joy, peace, fellowship. Ka Bible na si megini submit to and honestly, if this and what this background of verses. 15 to, um, is it 20? What 20? Huh? 21, Gadden. Oh, yeah, the normal. Yeah? If you call it mood, no problem. The way on a mood of this verses 21, I no problem. Oh, yeah, no, na this mood. Or, oh, do I call it mood? Or, oh, a kind of, um, Atmosphere. God gives you good hands of mission. Come again. And do you know that this submission goes to one another first? You know, under this atmosphere, for me to adjust to my wife's suggestion when it doesn't contradict God, the nature. I didn't need to. I don't need to struggle. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. I don't know. Are we following? And this atmosphere, the atmosphere is atmosphere of God's presence. Have you ever experienced the presence of God in your life? Eh? When you experience the presence of God, how do you feel? Do you normally feel like singing? You are not responding. Many of us are not talking. <laughs> Do you normally make melody in your heart? When? Huh? If you are angry, do you sing? Thank you. So, that is why sometimes when we teach submission, we teach it, it looks as if the context, the teaching will be okay. But ndi na anu ya anoge na onodo ha ga ji megene we na na ya odu normal please i'm trying to deal with something ga the normal something i had de ka nukuti you ama ka ga sime before 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 
Jesus showed me mercy and saved me. Honestly, I used to think that God, one almighty God, who is above, who is so angry with everybody, and that if you want to die, what happened? Ha! In la fire now. What happened? When Jesus showed me mercy, and as I keep learning and keep imitating him, eh? Na chopotana, umuhonye kachineke, the simple. Eh? God genye aka ke chopte. Because he chopte, o genye aka ki we ngote hi ko si ngote nebe chineke no. Chineke kadeng, chineke ke men nana nwa, karia nana nwa nko wa. Ha? Huh? The closer you draw, the more you relate with him, the more you fellowship with him, the more you receive grace to open up your heart and be simple like him. The more you get chopped down, over one big God somewhere in the heavens. Tikosri webeni ne, ne cho ne game again. Onye ya da ya. Mbo a kambi do chop ta ifa Bible si na e chegari ya. Inya e mo chine kena abo abanna. Iko ta kuhimba abanna. E de shoni go mo ya abanna. Abanna. Ha? Ha ha. Spirit of sonship. Abba Father. Ana ana abanya abanya. Ana agota ya agota. Abba Father. Amen. Amen. So, uh, let's take for instance. Open up and say, Kita. Open up and say, and I go on the name I can follow in the Lord. Is it okay? My helper. Where's him? Bomb me here now, but I'm going to make a baby. With time, never will I. Bomb. I'm annoyed. Where are you, Mary? San na jubu mmadi na unyo ya no konsia o kwa no yemeko o yeme ka mo cho ya no ogede ebe ono ma no no yemekwe no yemege ne no yeme saboro ya ando me ne ni kitoke fure we bo mi ya na bo we sim ai na kwa yi ye cheji we can stores o yi sim even in ka King Koza and I chat to yellow and the uh, sun. Mama got a end. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. This atmosphere. Can you use the word atmosphere of God's presence? Will it be a struggle? Will it be a struggle? Mane, mano, ne, no, heba. Ah? Yeah, he can have getting her quite to do with him. Yeah, the Holy Ghost will be now. What's the key to the Holy Ghost? There is something I don't know. Maybe this night God is trying to lay background, huh? Serious background. Some of our unions, Murike. Or the hanging. Or the two official. Two official. Come on, here, official. Eh? If you're an office, Kita, for counseling, you be able to move an official relationship. Man, I be no, no. I'm an official. We keep meeting in the veranda. I'm not going to do it. Because I'm going to say, it's all right. I'm going to be an official. Coffee is Libya. And I'm asking, yes, have your seat. I'm a because I'm going to use us because you connect because you connect. Emma, this. I'm a because. Can you feel your Very official. Phone, you're going to get what do you do? One, shh, you know me. Can you feel your mission? 
and is normal again a dignitary na anya mmadu some of our marriages the two official like oji afia ho na ko oji den friction kanko struggles kanko and we are not enjoying it after from this night you will start enjoying your marriage yeah. it looks to me as if god is first addressing our hearts praise the lord because maybe i don't know maybe god don't want hear me we can check you know we can save all the teachings god gave nya eba which all gave with the all gave with the word all gave with the teachings eh omo na enwe he this setting it okay banye na so that you nourish and cherish for kingdom um, advancement you are partner with it or cut off for tire and obu no obu di fe de no in this atmosphere e fun na you guys say no 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 me refer because automatically you change no again no he na me na partner mana maybe i aga ha ba iga nyo ife anya i ba echi am na ya i above from of money i a chop otane my ife mu na otun say relate with my wife mo anya wa ka na me ri ihe so nwem ka na me gine ka na me ri ihe maybe by tomorrow we'll be seeing it for this night god this merciful god must face address our hearts Obi I don't correct I don't open and we what it takes to not share it Obi I draw simple one of the things I na your chineke that we will never depart from the simplicity that is in Christ and we simplicity in the image Jesus I aga happen na Again, I your God. Who be you? Mwana ka heji mwe na angoni. Oya vi hana kuwa. Oya ka be kuchesi se. Submit to each other. Nyam. Ungu ano dunu ye mundo no. Or this easy. Can you mean? Ungu we make ne. Ungu ano. Praise the Lord. And don't ano do abu ko ano do chuku jia kaye wete. That's why we must cry to him. We must beg him. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Because oh uh, Yes, somebody go go do Igbo. I want to know how it Igbo Bible is we could that knowledge and intelligence because I don't even know the meaning of um, the interpretation of that thing in the Igbo. Um somebody go right from Igbo translation um verse 28 and 29 only. Okay? Hallelujah. Amen. Otu a ndi buzi ijikwa ugo ihu munye nka aka ha na anya dika ha huru aru nko onye nwe ha na anya Mhm Aru nko onye Dika ha huru aru nko onwe ha na anya Okay Onye na ahu munye nka aka ya na anya na ahu onwe ya na anya Nihira odi ho onye obula kpora aru onwe ya ase mbo obula Kama ona azu ya na elezikwa ya anya nka oma Ika Christ na emekwa nzuko ya nihi na Okay habuze Ona azu ya na enezuko ya anya nko oma Odim pakai mane Amo bro no otu aka Igbo translation so eh that's Igbo so we translate that's ona eme no reshi mugi ni ona azu ya ozuzu na emege no reshi mugi ni Na nesi anya nkoma. Na ona the is like you need something anya oma. Na enzo ozo ozo imegini. Ine anya oma. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amanna in the course of this meeting. God gave me say challenges and assignment. Serious one. In the course of this meeting. One woman I need such any in such challenge 
makana i believe in marriage we here to eto okwe ofuma ofuma o ye na eto ye ko si de eto eto na one nesi a na eto love the ihe ni ne na ozuzu a kwe ko ozu ka bore and inezi anya han cha na eto eto that's oga had oga had no ogugo otu ogugo kwa afo oga had no otu ogugo kwa afo amen Man, the first thing we go do, God, he bought a good day. Ka, I will keep your way be. I will go do an atmosphere where we can uh, nourish and also cherish. I see in Ugu. Yes, 2003. We gaban. So, Abuja, gaban Nugu State for something. We went to Nugu State. A brother, in the course of sharing fellowship, we need to share with us a very painful story. We say na, anytime ya we ran a fumunye, you were Jewobi. According to him, that he made mistake in choice. No buru nya kachine kesiya ogano no nya wajia kaya we choose nya. Muni mama of the ocha mama of ma to ma de siya mama normally o mama bet money normal with every other person. Outside the husband. Let me tell us the truth. A guy has one here like her. Eh? I like her. I'm getting that. I'm getting that. I don't know. Unless you want to see me, I'm not going to have a necessity. You need to hear this clause. Oh, when you come to me, try to be a big guy. Eh? The guy. We go to see and get a woman not like her. Oh my, oh my God! They are not following me. Man, when he go to get a new one, he but not like her. You cannot nourish what you don't have, what you don't like. He ain't got interest, man. You cannot. In your interest, na missions, you can give cover for missions. And when I say missions, I don't even mean only rural missions. Missions just are like, okay? Unki ge nye ife na ya bo, ki me gene? Ki fo na nya? Oh, hallelujah! I get to know to also. I buy again. I go to meet na. I get to go to meet you. I beg you, my boss. I saw you. 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 I'm not coming here to be fair. Man, me feel that this type of sharing, me forget me. I have a nine. I step out. A couple of them make it. Because. Like we are giving instance of that brother. In each and every one does on a map phone, he will never. Huh? Come on. To them, because na emura room for divorce or putting away. How do you make it? They are just managing to put up with this man or this woman and all the torment. Huh? 
Whether you want to respond or not, don't comment. Manachuku ya saw vye ba. Whether Marisi inugi of non es ni me choice. Of course, you makwana me me will of God me me ro. This is your wife. Ah? Nesi ife will of God. Onye abu digi bugene. Nya abu si will. As far as name go what God has joined. Oh ni me be inye unye ikuo. Because all day church, but also not as possible. I had many people making many arguments. Maybe you say, "So, boy, I chose no one. Go ahead, and say no." Now, boy, I'm not yeje. No, ni aye na be mugore ngwa. Go ahead, make it. Go yeje, be ye ye. Not yeje chonyo zo. Ona chonyo zo kanya no manka. Praise the Lord. The first thing, nga yawa God na ba ni abu can love good my wife. Can Holy Ghost ni gudu me can love all my wife from my heart. Ma ko love wo bido cherish me. No, ona rich ne buzo. Ozo e bido. Ozo zo. Ongo le ba je ne couples fellowship, couples retreat. One brother, I could get an cousin, could get an cousin, my con do king and I could see. Could you get a one brother, not at a mother would even look walk a thousands. One brother, not at a query when you go to not at all the cousin here. I'm not at all the men, look on out just here in here. Name what moon ye a cool mac a non bandem, but never now chalk and I zone way. Or look on a mid brother can now. Kaya. We don't know each other, but if only Mary and Hananya could be making chaos, unless it was really for necessity. And when you send away to get money, what do you so want to make? Huh? So, can I say still the baby but on ya? Can I say? When you are not on down or do it, but God will bring healing. God will bring healing. You can't have an anatomist in a big. In fact, I'm considering that in an atomment outside the Kabeta. Because all the need are all I feel like a church. No, I think church should be also a place of comfort. In the uh, no, I mean like in each other. He feel like all outside work or anything outside activities. I'm going to need to challenges there. Am I being mad to consider in where you comfort or so? The nekota ebe. Each thing I beg you, oh, I need making it. Oh, oh, na to, oh, no, do not you are. <laughs> I'm not talking about a good man or draw. We are not. I have deal with a good nigga draw. What are you going to enjoy? May God help us. Be kundi mu niya no heba na banya. Bawo kwa na phone no tutu. Bawo kwa na phone makana. I'm sensing that niya God do give me bad ya diego. Even though no meeting the short, na ebo basaro oge. But what I saw that when we get to go with the with the Holy Ghost, we need to go to the Anyanilu. We need to go to the Anyanilu. We need to see it again. You know, make it. You know, you know. You go so quick, try him. Go on and cause us here, man. Go on, yeah. I want to. I like to to see him, man. I try him again. You have to do it. Onye ona nwenke, onye nwenke. Ndi we do kwa na na because we we do never. Jesus wife, when Jesus wife kwa he me say go their own program na due to me care of couples. After this meeting, marriage is I get get better. Onwe ike expectation gine be unye gide adromet. Anyhow, now again, I know you. We're going to see the two affairs. 
and they die like in the doji. Man, imagine what happened. He told this God doji. And because your expectation is not being met. And now you are hearing the word of God talking of nourishing. Nourishing and what? Cherishing. And they are thinking of how you will nourish. You know, Adam said, this woman you gave to be with me. Before Adam said, this is now who? Bone of my bone and flesh of my flesh. She shall be called a woman. But now, the woman you did what? You have to be with me. When I married, when God gave me my wife, she was slain. Almost figure eight. A brother shared something with me, sorry, that he went to a hospital. One fat woman. I don't know her size. Huh? She's a staff in the hospital. So, when she closes work, she will want the husband to come and pick her up. And the wife will sometimes like to say, oh, my darling, are you around to carry The man will be doing kind of Because the size is too much now. And the man is afraid of identifying in the face of people this size of woman. If you tell that man now, say, nourishing and what? Cherishing. The man will say, who pay? In this fellowship, the Lord will bring healing. Yeah. Whether your wife has turned to become mommy yeah, but there is no problem. Is all of them you married? Is your own? Not my own. <laughs> or your husband. Maybe I should. Ha! I remember that sister. Anytime the husband wants to talk, she said, You don't know how to talk in public. One of the things God will do for us here is to restore that, that love, that love, that love that the one that God gives. Not the one that we whine ourselves and whine ourselves and just try to check the benefits. Maybe the benefits. There, there may be no benefit. There may even be no reason to love. There is the life, the Holy One of Israel in me that loves my wife. Do you think that Jesus loves your wife? Huh? Do you think that Jesus loves your husband? Huh? So that Jesus in you will also love your wife. What you need is to give him space. And in case if you are not born again, we are very sorry. Nothing good can come out of a natural life that is not regenerated. All these things we are sharing here is a mere stories to that life. Because everything we share here is based on the life of God in us. It's based on that life. It's not, it's not a natural thing. We are not sharing about our tradition. We are not sharing about what you can, what you can struggle to make up. No. It's what God will do in you. We are going to pray today and say, Lord, do something in the face of... 
In fact, sometimes, eh? In fact, we should even be challenged. Sometimes we see how, how some men do follow women. Some of them will look at women, look at women, and be following them, following them like good. Lord, do something in my wife that will make me to love her. Am I to follow her? Or she, is she to follow me? I think she should follow me. Submitting to each other. Uh-huh. Yes, I think the person that said follow is right a bit. Uh-huh. Because they are submitting to who? Uh-huh. But when, maybe when we come tomorrow, we see that there is wife submit. Apart from submitting to each other, there is what again? Wife submit. Not today. Amen. 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 Is God able to make me to see my to begin to see my wife from today differently? Is he able? Is he able? The problem of that brother is that I believe there is a way he sees his wife. Anytime he sees the wife like this, that thing will just yeah, he becomes angry. If your condition is like that, you are going from this meeting with testimony. You will just be surprised. You just, what is happening to me? Is he not this my wife that I, ah, I hate it from my heart. So what is happening? I just see what, oh, that thing that is happening is what God alone can do. Nourishing and cherishing for God's kingdom is advancement. God will use us as men and men, men and women to, is to advance his kingdom. To push this kingdom beyond where this, we meet this kingdom. To push. To take dominion. Amen. Amen. Now look at verse 25. Husbands, love your wives just as Christ also loved the church and gave himself for her. That he might sanctify and cleanse her with this washing of water by the word. That he might present her to himself a glorious church, not having spot or wrinkle or any such thing, but that he should be holy and without blemish. You know, see, all these things are reading here is just simply the way Jesus nourished the church and cherished her. The first thing Jesus did was to die for the church. <laughs> Hallelujah. When I, when I was meditating about this matter, I began to just think that it takes a man who has experienced death to marry. Sorry, to marry well. Everybody marries. Sorry, many people marries. But many may not marry well. The first thing Jesus did was to die for her. Hmm. Praise the Lord. To go to the center of doing what? Eh? Die for her. Die. You see the principle of the cross. I don't know whether God will show us the cross here. The cross. <laughs> dying for her. If, if you look at that dying, say, that he might. Please, are we together? Sorry, he died that he might. Abby, please, I don't know what I'm following. He died, gave himself for her. Huh? 
that he might sanctify. So, how did Jesus sanctify the church? He experienced the cross. He experienced the cross. It was in dying. He experienced the cross. That he might. So, now, husbands are to sanctify the wife. You know? See, please, I want us to listen. Most times, when we talk of husband sanctifying the wife and cleanse her, cleansing her with the washing of the water by the word, what comes to our mind is a kind of teaching your wife. I don't know. Please, I hope you are, are we together. What most times comes to our mind is being able to teach our wives the word of God. But uh, when you look at it, for Jesus to sanctify the word, what did he do first? Eh? He died. That he might. He died. That he might. So, it's like, if he did not die, he cannot sanctify the wife. Eh? So, so maybe that thing. Eh? We were sinners. He died. He died that he might he might bring the wife to his expectation. He first died to his death. He, thank you to his death. He first died. Hi. I don't know what God may be showing us in this meeting. But what I see now is that I need to check for myself first whether it's which Anna that wants to marry and sanctify his wife. If it is which Anna that wants to marry and sanctify my wife, then the kind of wife I will produce will be like which Anna. Whatever is born of the flesh, flesh produces flesh. Double flesh and the spirit produces spirit. So, which Anna must die and give Christ chance so that Christ will sit where which Anna used to sit and marry the wife. It will look as if it is which end are marrying. People will say you are trying. Ah, ogre. If you go to your in-laws, they will say you are one of the best ogre we have now. The best in-law. But it's not about you. You experience death. Christ has done an exchange in you. It's no longer you that live. It's who living in you? Christ. Hallelujah. So, he gave himself that he might. Oh my God. Please, are we together? Honestly, for me, for many years, I thought that a wife, a husband sanctifying the wife is just to make sure that he can teach the wife very well. I thought it's a matter of teaching your wife very well. I didn't know that for me to sanctify, I must first experience the cross. I will, I will have to experience death. Amen. Amen. Because it, if it is human nature, old man that wants to sanctify you, I don't know, I don't know what can come out of it. You just you produce something natural. You just produce something natural. But what God wants to produce is something of the spirit. He made them one so that he might do what? Have godly offspring. That offspring He's talking of something that we come out of that union, oneness. We be godly something. So something that look like God. It's not just necessarily biological children. Each time we say godly offspring, our mind just goes straight to biological children. But at a point, I begin to believe that when you say that he might have godly offspring, anytime you come near that marriage, anything that comes out of that marriage, we look like God, godly offspring. Nothing ungodly. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. My joy is that the Lord is already here and He's doing something here. When we begin to be real, when we begin to Allow God, then we begin to be real. 
you begin to be real. I'm trusting God that God will visit all of us here. In this meeting, God will visit all of us. He will touch us. He will regenerate. He will transform. He will renew. He will restore. He will perfect what consigned us. God will use us to create an environment of joy and love after now. Your home will not be a place of tension. Where people will be always, uh, they are afraid of this, they are afraid of that. Yes. Everywhere is under, uh, everywhere is tensed up. No. Your marriage will no longer be under friction again. God is smoothing everything as we respond to him. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Ananias could not sanctify his wife. Ananias was a crafty man. Two of them will go and decide something in the secret. Say, nah, let's just do like this. If they ask us, we tell them this. This one is a bigger tortoise. This one is a younger tortoise. And the day they, go, they tried it in the presence of God, both of them died. I don't know what you have been doing here. Maybe your, maybe your husband or your wife, your wife knows that you are a crafty man. I have been seeing that craftiness. Nothing is like this. Nothing is open. Everything is just like that. Just like that. Just cover up things. God will visit us in this meeting. Are you sensing that God has been bringing you to the cross? Each time you come near a cross, you dodge. Each time you come to the place where crucifixion, practical experience of the cross will take place in your life, you go and help yourself again. Jesus. Wives, you are help. You are help. When you are sensing that your husband has come to the cross and he wants to help himself, Tell him, don't help yourself. Experience death. Maybe you didn't know, you think that he's, he's helping himself. You don't know that he's prolonging a food. He's prolonging something. Ha! Huh. Oh. God must help us here. I consider myself fortunate getting married as a Christian. I am grateful to God for many things. Many things. I don't know where. I don't even know where to start. When I see what people struggle in their marriage. Struggle, struggle, struggle. It's not that I don't have struggle at all. What I have is very little. And anyone that comes up, God will handle it. Praise the Lord. God will just handle it. We are going to have time of testimony tomorrow, but Eh? If I have opportunity, I will share. If, but I, others will have chance. If, if there is much time, I will share. Sometimes I will have a matter that I'm dealing with. I wake up in the night. I will just pray like this. I go up and down. I say, oh, oh, oh. in fact, the one that happened just a few weeks, my wife will just be sleeping because I, I believe that there are some hours of the night I don't need to disturb her. If I'm the head, the head is up. Eh? And the head should take responsibilities. You know, everything I do that she should do. There are some things I should secure for her. Have Jesus secured many things for us? Eh? That is it. So, time comes when I wake her, but there are times I will just allow her to sleep because She's like my baby. Abby? Yeah. My baby, ba? God bless you, Sister Chicken. So, I will pray, I will pray, I will be disturbed. I will want to go and I wake up, I will just pray, I pray like this. And she will just wake up and say, I received this, I received this. In fact, the one that happened last year, two, three weeks ago, two or three weeks ago, as she just said that, my heart just did. (sighs) 
As God will begin to walk in your marriage, eh? you begin to do what Adam did. It's not once and for all. That this is now the bone of my bone and the flesh of my flesh. Is it once and for all? Ah, ah! It's not once and for all. It happens and it happens again and again. As you experience the message of God in your marriage, you keep saying, this is now the bone of my bone. Huh? The flesh of my flesh. You are my wife. You are not just a woman that came to be with me. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Let us pray. Do something new in my life. Something new in my life. Something new in my life. Oh Lord, do something new in my life. Something new in my life. Something new in my life. Oh Lord. Oh Lord, do something new in my life. Something new in my life. Something new in my life. Oh Lord, do something new in my life. Something new in my life. Something new in my life. Oh Lord. I cannot do without you. I cannot do without you. I cannot do without you. Oh Lord, I cannot do without you. I cannot do without you. I cannot do without you. Oh Lord. If you notice that God, one way or the other, have touched your matter this night. I want us to pray together. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know how it has been with you. Maybe there are a lot of frictions. There is no joy. There is no joy. Don't pretend about it. You will need to respond to God. You are not happy. You are not happy. And if we say nourishing, cherishing, it will be difficult for you. Because the ground is not called. The, see, the ground, there is no ground. There is no the environment is not there. And it will be so difficult that sometimes we may end up asking question upon question until the meeting is over. God forbid. Sometimes what your heart is telling you is, nah, this thing that is, is it this, is it this my wife? Is it this my husband? And all of that. As we'll be singing this song again, sister or brother, if you know how you will respond to God this night. If you want to kneel down there, good. If you want to stand up where you are, good. I believe that God will be bringing about showing us practical ways of nourish. But this night, if we don't handle first the conditions of our hearts, the atmosphere of our lives at the present, trying to practice those practical things will be somebody trying to build his castle on the air. I'm telling you the truth. When God was talking about uh, making melody, singing songs, and all that, he was trying to show us the environment. The environment. A joyful man. A joyful man. 
can consider his wife's suggestions. A joyful woman will freely submit to the husband. An angry man, an angry man, an angry woman cannot. If she's doing anything, she's just pretending. If you are talking of doing something from the heart, it's not there. It's not there. And <laughs> if we don't enter this environment that God is showing us, what God will show us about nourishing and cherishing will be like, will be like load that a man cannot carry. I tell you the truth. So when, you, when God helps you to enter this environment, the environment of his presence, to pay any price for your wife to receive help will not be too much. Will not be anything. To pay any price to submit and obey a husband will not be anything. If we have the environment, how many of men, how many of us men or women have experienced death? Death to ourselves so that Christ will live in, in us. How many of us have experienced the cross? Are you not sure it is two crafty human beings living together but carrying the name of Jesus and Bible? It could even be pastors or pastors' wives. This meeting, this night, as we pray, is ending in a very sober way so that we can go, including myself, and begin to quietly ask the Lord, Lord, sit in my wife and sit in me and love my wife. Sit in me and love my wife. That kind of love you are talking about. The one I have been doing is as if I'm doing her a favor. I want the one that you will love her. So that by the time we come tomorrow, as we'll be praying together and begging God and asking God, show us the way to nourish and cherish in order for the kingdom of God, in order to advance God's kingdom, we must have been in the environment where it is possible. Ah. Holy Ghost, do it again, do it again.